Hello everybody. Uh, just got done watching uh, uh, Anna's vlog and uh, um, I totally 100% agree with her. Uh, Russia is a bunch of bullies and uh, I know we're not perfect here in the United States but I can promise you that no one in NATO and especially here in the United States wants anything to do with Russia. Um, you can have that country. We don't want to control you. you can, your fate of your own destiny and whatnot within your uh, internationally recognized borders. Uh, but when you invade into Georgia and you're still there and you screwed up Syria and now you're trying to screw up Ukraine, enough's enough. And now you're running around and running your mouth in Russia saying how you're going to go to war with NATO. Um, please. All it would take is... Um, probably about 20,000 troops plus our uh, mer military capabilities and, and, and wipe you off the face of the earth in, in Ukraine. Um, we're not going to attack you in your own damn country, but we are definitely going to kick your ass out of Ukraine. Um, that, that's ridiculous, dude. And don't even threaten. And if you're man enough, uh, I hear you hide in a bunker a lot, Putin. Uh, if you're man enough, I'll, I'll fly out to freaking Moscow and we can have an old-fashioned 17th century duel. You and me. Winner takes all. Um, so if you're up to the challenge, why don't you uh, put up or shut up? Don't you think it's funny how we have over 140 million people in, in Russia and they all follow bah, like sheep. And they just sit there and they watch uh, uh, the same TV shows day after day saying how uh, Russia is a superior race, everybody else is Nazis. Um, one thing that they are really smart about is they know how to scare countries uh, by talking tough. Uh, the other thing is, is uh, they know how to uh, get into cyberspace and uh, uh, we make a lot of bad political decisions by electing uh, rotten officials here in the United States. But I gotta tell you something, uh, when he threatens to blow up the entire world uh, with nuclear weapons, he isn't an idiot. Uh, because if that happens, uh, Moscow is gone. St. Petersburg's gone. You know, yeah, we're gonna have a nuclear winter, but um, the whole world would turn against him because of the devastation it would cause across civilization. And, you know, if they want to go back to the, you know, 1400s, and, uh, which I doubt they do, but uh, that's their choice. Uh, but if Russia is tough enough and man enough to do stuff, uh, let's fight this uh, conventional war, man. Uh, you keep threatening NATO, you keep threatening the United States. You want to, your people on TV are saying how they want to take over California and Alaska. Um, let's go. Quit talking. You, get, you talk a lot. Yeah, you're a talker. Actions speak louder than words. And your actions are quite impotent. I, I mean, you, you said that you were going to take over Ukraine in three days. My God, you're such a limp dick, man. It's, it's been two and a half years. It's just nuts. Um, there's no end in sight for you, you know, and I can't believe the oligarchs put, put up with you. Uh, it's kind of crazy. Uh, those oligarchs, man, uh, they could have all their money back if they got rid of you.